Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our modded series. So I have been doing a little bit of off-camera work, so I guess we'll go through a few things first. Ooh, a little bit of a lag, but that's okay. Let's pause this for a second. We'll resume it now. So the little village that we started building in the last one, uh, we do have the trees and vegetation in where it should be. We've also installed a little hauling post. And right now what I'm doing here is just finalizing a couple more trees just on the upper levels there. It seems we don't... Oh, we do have the reach now. Uh, wait a second. Oh, no, we do not. Okay, that's fine. Now, we are still in a drought. I guess that's probably a new drought, actually. Uh, I believe uh, maybe 20 days have passed since uh, we closed the last episode. What have you guys done? Uh, how are you? So smart. Uh, yikes. Okay. Okay. Fine. Can this be... Oh, they are the highest priorities. Okay, interesting. Let's try and use one of those draggable utilities. And what we are going to say is... Let's just pause everything in here. Oh dear, yeah, that's a lot of notifications, but that's okay. So these are paused now. And uh, let's talk about that section a little bit later. Let's uh, jump back over here. Uh, to quickly test out the depth of the... The water and if the little still works i've placed down a temporary one which the beavers will hopefully build very shortly we are going to get yeah rid of this access once the infrastructure in is in place so that's going to be the straight route over here and then i'm just kind of slowly starting to plan out how and where do we want to take this uh, sort of district to there's a lot of uh, stuff we could expand this little village around the this cliff area just behind the little lake or a reservoir that we are going to have here as well. And uh, since the forestry area has expanded quite a bit, we already have 1,500 logs stored in this district as well. And uh, yeah, they are slowly starting to fill up, uh, I guess, I think, yeah. Um, right, anyways, next thing. So this area was drying up fairly quickly because it's not very deep. So what I've also done is added in a couple of uh, triple floodgates over here and it seems okay. So this section is now done. Which means we can take you out and probably stick another triple uh, platform in there. Now I am also uh, starting to block this area in to, you know, let the water build up even higher. So by doing this extra bit of dam in here... Okay, actually never mind, we're only gaining, what is it, one level. But that is already enough to start flooding uh, this river in here. And uh, even though it's not going to go up all the way there, well, it's just going to look nice and green in this area. And uh, yeah, uh, we do need, we still need another district center somewhere up here to really um, exploit this area a bit more as well. Okay, so that's uh, this area. I think, uh, oh yeah, you are done now. So all I have to do is stick one of these in. I believe they should be able to build from the corners, but... Just in case, let's do this dam first and then we'll do the another levy right over there. Do, 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 do. Let's have a look. Oh, you guys are out of logs, aren't you? No, you still have a hundred in there. Okay, okay. Can we... Where are we exporting logs? Oh, from this one. Right. And... Where are you transporting them? To here? Right. And we also are moving metal blocks, paper... Let's see our limits. So logs. Are we going to need some more? Maybe we do 150. Do you know what? That should be fine for them. Okay, let's have a look at this area real quick as well. So, I believe we can get rid of this. Yeah, this area, I think I mentioned before in the previous episode. Bit of a waste of resources because now we do have this suspension bridge over here, but... You know what? It's okay. It's fine. Oh, is any water going through? No. 6.9 days since the drought ends. We do have a lovely forest here. Honestly, I cannot remember if that was already in place uh, last time I recorded. Because um, actually it was about a week ago when I did make the recording. So, so yeah. Uh, and this area, the trees are starting to expand now as well, which is great. Okay, beautiful. Now, bit of a bigger project over here. Lots of dynamites going down, little section is already done, and we are starting to do the same up here. 
right in this one we also have access however let's just double check okay so you can reach all the way there right 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 we need two more how about we put down i don't know something like this is that gonna help us no not really how about now yep we do have access to all of it now okay well that is good now <laughs> i guess yeah let's just stick even more uh let's see oh dynamite there we go and a couple in this area as well now at the top over here this is only two levels i do want three in total i believe and in here i have a feeling we don't quite have the range for this okay so that means uh, another temporary district. Um, well, I did plan to move this further down eventually anyways. Yeah, quite a bit of reach in here. All these buildings could be, you know, maybe we can just squeeze them in into this area. I would like to have some farms perhaps down there. But the distances seem to be quite high if they start running back and forth. Well, we're not really building a lot up here, I think. I mean, there isn't a whole lot of area to play with, but then again, if you guys really want some sort of a cliffside or mountaintop construction project up here, then do let me know and, uh, you know, we can change our plans. If not, we can probably leave it as forest area. I mean, of course, we still do want to demolish this and lower it further down, but um, yeah, I guess we'll see. Okay, one more section of dynamites why are you doing these ones first you got a whole massive area that i'm pretty sure i placed down first okay you know what it's fine it is okay we'll leave you guys at that and moving on don't think i've done a whole lot in here yeah we've finally connected up this section here as well i think i forgot to do it in the last episode even though we got rid of those trees but yeah now it's all connected up and we're getting rid of those trees as well purely because we want a few more carrots yep that's that's why we're doing this uh let's check the food in this district oh potatoes is a problem as well hmm too much wheat and bread but no potatoes right 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 so maybe uh, maybe that's something we'll start expanding into if this is all carrots then maybe this turns into potatoes I think we should do that, and actually, you have the range all the way there. You don't. What about you guys? Oh, you have range still here as well. Although, I'd like those trees to keep expanding. It's fine. They don't need those potatoes right now anyways. I mean, they do, but it it's okay. Castle side of things seems to be going okay as well. Now, I have not placed down any more, more of those walls because uh, let's move over here there's another thing that i have been working on uh, where shall we start i guess we'll start, uh, start from here so we've got all the windmills in but the power is not quite passing through just yet is that the last link we want to do yep and this one okay so we hide the water oh okay so they have done all the way here and most of Oh, actually, they've done all of these sections. Except you. So maybe we'll have to take... Are you able to... Yes, you should be able to build this one. Okay, highest priority. We've got a few materials in. And highest priority for you as well. So you're saying you can't build that one. Okay, we're going to have to waste a few more resources. But that's okay. So we can just connect this. We are nearly there. Right. Now... It's going to come through here right now. I know in the future, if we do change this around, that's okay. All we're wasting now is logs. It can just go through here. And same thing, just come straight through, I hope. But I guess we'll see. Anyways, for the time being, uh, that's going to be a little bit tricky or maybe not. So you're going to have to step down. Let's see, we don't need this access anymore, or do we? We wanted to do another layer of anything. Um, hmm. Now, maybe we'll... Okay, we'll figure out alternative way. But for the time being... I'm um, sorry. 
you're gonna have to go because power comes through here it needs to step down one level i believe and i know we're gonna block ourselves in but that's okay with me now the next question is are you on the ground level yes you are sorry for the very chunky camera movements but it's a bit of a pain i know we can go layer down but don't really have time for that so yeah uh, there we go power's just gonna wrap around oh and you're a, oh no you're oh it is a problem never mind off you go bring you through there i think you're not needed and all right let's do the corner bits first this one this one you you oh wait a second you're gonna go this way right and you're not connected anyway. Wait. Uh, wait a second. We are still gonna have to go down. Okay, here we go. Now, why are you saying that this is no good? Oh, maybe they don't have a way to build them up yet. That's okay. We'll fix it up in a second. So this platform is gonna go back in there. We might be getting this connected. Oh, you've done the last. Okay. Just one more. And... Ah, oh, we are so close. How much power? Zero. Fine. Okay, anyway, so that's the windmills. That's the cable management that we have here. And the reason why it's going down... Well, I know we talked about demolishing this area. Um, however, this was already clear, clean, empty. And, well, we don't have a lot of logs, but we've got a few in here. So I've placed a few buildings down that can increase our... Oh, and now we're fine with planks. Okay, well, great. Anyways, that's the plan. I don't know if this is a temporary solution. I hope it's not because it's taken me quite some time to build all this stuff in here. And now all we gotta do is just build a few more links, which should be fairly quick as well. I believe we have a lot of gears in this district already, don't we? Uh, 72. Well, I'll take it. It's fine. Now in uh, here, I guess we're gonna have to bring you over through a bit annoying, but so be it. Anyways, another thing I've installed in here are a couple of those large water wheels. I know those droughts aren't very, sorry, the wet seasons aren't very long, and we're not gonna get power out of this for, you know, too, uh, too, too long. But, you know, if there was water, sorry, windmills aren't working, we're in a wet season, then at least we're getting some power from those large water wheels as well. Uh, wait a second. Do you still have water? Yes, you do. Everything seems to be pretty low, but that's okay. 4.7 days, I think we'll be able to su survive it. Now, the next annoying thing in here is I don't really want to do it one by one. Hmm, what can we do? I think I know what we can do. A bit of extra resources will be wasted on this, but... You know what? It's fine. You're gonna go this way. You can't walk through anyways. Okay, so we are fine. Uh, let's just, yeah, place you all right about so. Bring you down a few levels. Not Okay, there we go. And now we'll do the same. Uh, excuse you. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, connected. Couple more. Okay, so now you should be, well, you will be connected up. As soon as this is all built, and I think, yeah, we should probably put some roads down as well. Let's see if that helps. Okay, another shaft is done, which means we can go another level up. Okay. Ah, okay, beautiful. I like it. Now, how much power? Oh, that could be an extra thousand in total. Yeah, and that would meet our needs. Well, it's off again anyways. Now, next thing that I'd like to start doing whilst they're building everything else. Uh, let's just speed it up real quick. Is, well, I think we're struggling with our accommodation services. So, since we do have this lovely little area that's just by the dry river, it is going to be flooded hopefully soon. I mean, we could always lower it as well but i think right now with uh, um how we are with dynamites and all those all of them being exported uh we'll leave it for another day what i would like to do however is to create this little village that i guess it bends around the the river here 
Now checking the range. I know we're not gonna have, yeah, not too much to play with. And the housing style, well, since these houses are the iron teeth, and uh, let's just imagine that all of these beavers are working up in the in the mines there, I was thinking maybe we'll have add some housing for the beavers that are living, or oh, sorry, working in the in the farming district. So yeah, that should be something lovely that we can do. And I suppose we could... Oh, well that's no water anymore. Can we go any lower than this? Yes, we can. Okay, good. Now, what we can do over here is starting to expand this out a little bit. Now, maybe we'll leave a couple of spots in here. And do we want this to be right by the river? No, I don't think we do. Would be nicer if it was... If we leave a bit of a gap in here so we can plant some trees and things. So... Like so. Like so. And let's check the range out. Just to be safe. Okay, not too bad. What we would also like to have is these all these dead trees gone. For the housing itself, if this is decorations sort of stuff, then uh, and we can't. Hmm, we shouldn't really. Yeah, I think we should place the houses as close to the road, uh, mainly to to the uh, distances and the reach. So let's see. You're massive. I think it will be much more lovely if we. If we use those smaller houses, and something like this could actually look very lovely. And don't want to place a road right here, because that's going to look a little awkward. You still have range, so... Let's see, how far will this range go? Okay, if we have something like that over here. Hmm, or maybe we take you out. How about now? Let's have a quick check. Okay. Oh, just about... Let's take you out so the reach is going uh, right about there. Okay, okay. That is okay. And we could do one of those houses. Actually, I haven't used any of the small ones. So how about we do something like this? Yeah, and we can do another one right in this corner here. If we get rid of you. And obviously, we are going to have to put some roofs above it as well. Oh, that may be now. This, I would like to do another... Do we want a rooftop? But getting up there is not the easiest. I think right now, let's put some roofs in here. Until we can come up with some better ideas. Which way is better? Oh, okay. Well, that's kind of funky looking as well. Why don't we do it this way? Oh, that's a four. However, let's see what happens. Um, <laughs> maybe something like that. Okay, there we go. Lovely little village for the beavers. And they are going to... I would like to put a little station for them where they can bray as well. So maybe, maybe we'll do one here. And one right about there. We shall definitely need a few benches. If they are a little tired, they can just rest. And it seems there are a few... Uh, don't want to block the the windows too much. But a uh, few decorations. Oh, uh, we do have all this space in here though. Let's put you right next to this house and I hope we do have enough space for the beavers now yes we do okay lovely so we do have this extension of the the village and uh, yeah hopefully these guys are all farmers falling post okay that will do as well beautiful check the power shafts okay you're almost done as well where are you we need this one and will you look at that they've got a few levels already in and seems I think they should be pretty much done as well. Ooh, 1,000 water. Left 300 here, 500 there. I don't think we have problems in this district. In here. Yeah, yeah, they are okay. Um, <laughs> I think in the long run, probably want to have a few water pumps somewhere around this area. Maybe even this lake. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. 
Definitely want to lower it one more or a few more levels, but it's okay for now. Let's focus on these areas first. Oh, and actually, yeah, you're probably all waiting for me to detonate all this, don't, aren't you? Okay, let's do it. Alright, so that's one done. Let's do another one. Beautiful. Okay, there we go. Now, can you guys... Uh, okay, all the side ones are done. So that should be good. I don't want to... Yeah, let's leave them for now. You're done, okay. Nice. And we can let them finish the rest. We... Yeah, we still have enough dynamites here and they're constantly bringing in more as well. Oh, wow, look at you. You're all full. What about these guys in here? Are you still getting... Yes, you are getting logs. And... What's going on? You are... Oh... One thing we should do, 100% in here. Let's do distribution limits. And for the logs, wait, 2000. If we take this off, that should be infinity, right? Yeah, let's see what happens. Are you going to start carrying more logs in now? Yes, you are. Okay, so that seems to be working great. We can leave you at that then. Almost time to, if we're already redoing some of the housing and things. I mean, we've got this lovely new village over here. And you've done all the trees. Okay, beautiful. Um, <laughs> I would like to maybe rearrange some of those houses here as well. But I'm just thinking this could be a nice area for the houses. If the district center moves maybe somewhere up here. Yeah, that's uh, definitely going to give us a lot more range up there. I have placed down... Oh, but we don't really have any logs. What are you guys up to? Why are you not transporting logs? Okay, so you have the logs. Wait a second, are you saying... No, they should be able to get through here, right? Yeah. Let's see, planks, explosives, logs, 150 in this one. But no one's really... Because uh, we don't have the haulers. Oh yeah, I remember now. I turned them all off because we are busy building all those dynamites. Okay, let's leave this for another day then. Yeah, the priority should be getting this section done in here. So we can hold more water. Uh, wait a second, five, six hundred only left. Two hundred in here, three hundred in here. Well, that's not good. Let's drop it down. We're gonna have to send all the water into Dragon's Keep. There isn't a whole lot in left in here. Ah, oh, which means we'll probably want to deepen this even further. I mean, I do remember previously talking that I might want to um, raise this up maybe by at least two levels. And I guess now that we do have them on the platforms, it should be a little bit easier to do, and if the water level is too high, that means they are no longer usable. What we can do is switch on these pumps here instead. Yeah, definitely an option. Okay, that's all the water gone now, which means... I guess I'll leave it open. I mean, it's 1.8 days left. Uh, quick check. How are we doing with our cables? Well, they're almost done, and that's going to be fairly quick, knowing... Um, oh, that's the water. Well, yeah, that, that's it. We're, we're done. We're done with the water. Shouldn't really export it anymore. I think we're still exporting it to some districts. Let's see. Water. No. Let's take this off. And we're sending water into here as well. Okay, how about we place down two like so? Go to a storage tank somewhere there, and maybe you become the highest priority for our beavers. Yeah, this section is done as well. It's not connecting through. That's fine. Okay, there we go. 
Really hope you guys are building this now. Do have logs, right? Yep, they are grabbing logs now. Okay, so that's great. They should be building them. And then we'll reassign a few of those beavers. Right, so you are completed now. And we still have a few spare spots in some of them. And all we need, yeah, all those plants are dead, but that's okay. Let's take a look over here. Few of those storage areas are now done. What is the problem? Oh, now you should have water in here and lots of food as well. And the little seems to be working. Okay, that's good to know because now that means we can definitely deepen this area even further to ensure that we are keeping them running. I mean, you can see it here. I think this drought was like 30 days or 28 days actually. Uh, no, it must be less. It must have been 20 otherwise this one will be dry as well yeah i am wrong it must have been only like 20 or less days of a drought how about in this area okay you are still keeping this area green which is good all right let's check this out as well this dam seems to be complete wonderful same around here so all we need now let's give it the highest priority because the wet season is about to start and you're done as well. Okay, good. So yeah, we are just going to need this last piece in here, which should allow us to increase the water in here. Now, I am thinking we may want to remove one of those. But let's see. Once the water starts flowing, then um, yeah, we, we'll, we'll know what we need to do. Now, next thing. I'm sure that the ones... Uh, the ones of you that have followed this series, I did talk um, in one of the previous episodes about cutting down this area with some dynamites. So, so yeah, uh, shall we start doing this already? I mean, we do have this temple up here. So do we really want to build another one? It could also be a bit of a storage area for, I don't know, maybe we could hide some of our food in here perhaps could always do this in the bottom and then using what were they called again these arches and then yeah put some more storages above that's actually that's not very hidden then because that's quite high yeah or maybe like houses i know i wanted to keep it for temple fine let's leave this project as it is right now as well since we don't really seem to be having a lot of great ideas now once all of these projects are done in here which is almost now i believe yep you're connected you should be connected so all we have left to do in here let's uh, fix this up as well connect the power okay 800 is coming through all the way here now Let's hope there's no beavers down there. Alright, they're not down there. Shall we... Yeah, we shall remove this one. Highest priority. You're done. Which means... Oh, we could have... No, we cannot. Okay, what we need in here is a set of stairs. And now a few platforms, which actually means... You know what? Let's get rid of this. Okay, there we go. And that actually should be the highest priority as well. Well, let's do it for this whole area so they can reach this power uh, shaft over there. You're building this one already, so this is great. Now, all we need here is one of you, then this one and this one. Okay, please get to building you. We'll speed it up. Maybe they'll get it done quicker. Uh, yeah, okay, so we've got a beaver doing this one. Let's hope they're not going to block him in. And they are... Never mind. We're okay, I think. And let's see if we highlight you. 5,000. We are connected. It's running all the way down here. Power's going through 5,200 in total now. Yeah, that's quite a lot of power output on, on these windmills. So that's actually fantastic. I mean, it would have been more useful earlier in some of those episodes, but right now we I think we have enough blanks. However, because power is flowing through all these houses, we can start putting down some more workshops for the for the gears. And the way I've done it as well, I wanted to make sure the cables are 
all the way behind. I wanted to make sure that I don't have to destroy them every time we expand this. So now I can just keep building those workshops in here as long as we have the range, of course. Yes, we do. So yeah, that's good. We can do a few gear workshops, but right now it seems it is going pretty good. Oh, another cool thing that I did want to do in here. Let's uh, resume all this. Uh, you should have access, right? Yeah, you do. Uh, was to put a platform here instead of instead of the platforms. Oh yeah, that's the word I was looking for. I mean, we might have to do... Oh no, we can't do a small one here, so it has to be a big one. Which then means it is a bit too high, isn't it? Wait, let's see. No, that's the height of the wall. Okay, so this is perfect, actually. Yeah, as soon as they build all of this, so we keep a little bit of water in here. Do we still have water here? Yes, we do. And then we can demolish all of those levees. I know, waste of resources, but that is okay. It does take me sometimes a little bit longer to figure out how I want to build, but hey, this could be pretty cool since we do have a lot of metal, right? We do, yeah, 167. I mean, you take 500, but after some time, this should be built right about here. So then we at least have some actual use for the metal as well. But anyways, this episode has already been pretty long. And we've gotten a few things done. Here comes the water. Hopefully no one's died of thirst. Uh, old age. Yeah, I always forget to check this. Well, I think we're good. Here comes the water. Maybe we'll have a quick look at how this plays out. And yeah, well, things are still green. So that canal over here is definitely very good. And I do want to give it a bit more access as well. Maybe we'll go through here. Oh, I do have to re rearrange things in here. But we're first going to need some logs in those stockpiles. And where are you? Okay, here it goes. Uh, to, this reminds me, I do need floodgates in different areas as well. To control the level of water and release it onto the lower levels. But okay, so that... Oh, that's very laggy. Let's pause it for a second. Have a look maybe in this section here. Maybe I'll skip ahead just a little bit and we'll have a look at it once it's, you know, starting to fill up the rest of it. All right, and here we go. The water is flowing through a very nicely, actually. There seemed to be a bit of a flood in that side over there, but things seem to have stabilized now. And uh, yeah, okay, here we go. Looking nice and green. It's flowing through this section and that should pass through the rest of it as well. So I think I'm pretty happy with this. Lovely little river. We could always do some water bumps. Um, no, never mind. Let's not talk about future plans. I think we're pretty happy how this is looking now. And uh, yeah, in the, in the next episode, we'll carry on. I might do a little bit of off-camera off work just to fill up these log piles. I mean, this side is full, this side isn't. We'll uh, slap down one of those district centers here as well and use up all the logs and, well, I guess we'll have to send over a massive workforce into here to get this pyramid build started. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one.